No tengo hambre. Que además ya me voy a ir. My name is Ashley Solis. I'm a senior at Watsonville High School. I'm currently applying for universities. Me being first generation going into college, it's a bit like, I don't know what to do. Like, where do I go? It's like I'm choosing my own decisions for my own life. So it's, in a way, it's kind of difficult. I get in at 10 p.m and then I go to work. Other one where I'm usually at is um, the, the frost frizzy. I had to take out the little pieces of fresas that have a lot of ice on them. Your hands get like really cold. And then I get out usually at six. What I would do is like, I would come home and then sleep for an hour and then like wake up, get, get dressed, and then go to school, and I try to finish like all the homework they gave us. Las chinas por Está arrullando el rey muy mal. Anda en la china para que comas algo. ¿Eh? Así dice que ahorita. ¿Quién? ¿Are you gonna shower first or must shower first? ¿Eh? Me. Are you gonna shower too? I need to go take a bathroom. Okay, hurry up. Oh, you can't see your notices there, yeah? Usualmente yo en las noticias he escuchado que migración siempre llega en la madrugada. Hay veces cuando tocan la puerta, mis hijos también se, se espantan. Lo único que le digo a mis hijos es que hay que abrir las puertas porque no sabemos quiénes son. Where we live, it's not an apartment. It's just a room for like six of us. Did you guys a lot of homework or todavía no? Am I pulling your hair?
I kind of had to miss school because, like, my mom had to go to work because if she didn't go to work, there was, like, no money for rent. And, well, I had to stay with my sisters and take care of them. Just a little too much. This is the one we was used to, right? And congratulations to our Wildcat softball team. You know what? Those softball girls have really demonstrated if you work hard, you can get to your dreams. Have a great weekend, Wildcats. Dream big and work hard. about what you just saw, don't all jump. It's, I know, slow down everybody. I'll try to put your hands in order. That, that's agency. That's what agency looks like. When I talk about you guys having agency, that's what that is. The things I want you to be thinking about for next week, we haven't talked about college crates in a little while. I want an update on scholarships you've applied for, um, what schools, you're narrowing it down to your decisions. I want to know what schools you're going to. I also want to be able to talk to each of you about financial plans. In other words, where have you gone with this? How have you progressed? If we take a look at your attendance, how how's your attendance? I had 36 cuts. They had told me I wasn't gonna graduate. out my parents with money. They didn't ask me to do it, but I mean, I knew they were going through through problems with money and everything, so I decided to help out. So in a way, I'm trying to be a help for them, but it is gonna restrain me a bit from my goals. Once you get in, if you're hit with the smell, it's like right away, you know, oh, hard work. It's an everyday thing you have to do. At the fields, they're really not gonna like care about, like if you're feeling bad, 